the franchise, John Cena. The following is an eight-man battle royal. Making his way to the ring from West Newbury, Massachusetts, weighing in at 251 pounds. the showcase of Immortals. A name he definitely earned. He competed for the WWE Championship in seven consecutive WrestleManias. Since then, Cena has had epic clashes with the likes of The Rock, The Undertaker, and Bray Wyatt. He's already cemented himself as a WrestleMania icon, but I see many more WrestleMania moments in Cena's future. And I think we're gonna see one more here tonight. Here comes the head of the table, the Tribal Chief. And representing the Bloodline from Pensacola, Florida, weighing in at 265 pounds, the undisputed WWE Universal. The head of the table is at the showcase of the Immortals. We've seen, but there's no bigger win than winning the biggest WrestleMania match in history, unifying the WWE and Universal titles by defeating Brock Lesnar. The most dominant competitor in WWE history. And from Minneapolis, Minnesota, weighing in at 295 pounds, Brock! He's had many main event encounters against the likes of Triple H and Roman Reigns, even out of the Undertaker streak. But this man has a WrestleMania chip on his shoulder after losing the championship unification match against Roman Reigns at the biggest WrestleMania match of all time. He truly seems to enjoy combat. Of course, Cole, because it's what Lesnar was built for. The battlefield is his home. Yeah, Brock Lesnar relishes the chance to go out and simply conquer. Because Brock wants to be on the very top of the mountain. And he won't be denied. And from Hagerstown, Maryland, weighing in at 200. 30 pounds with no LA Knight's name. It was a top name in NXT the moment he arrived. Same result with WWE. Well, I don't think anybody's going to argue the point that LA Knight is one of the most arrogant competitors in NXT history. I would agree with you, Saxton, but LA Knight has earned that arrogance with big wins over top talent. But now LA Knight is set to dominate all of WWE. Batista gets 
what he wants. Six foot six, 295 pounds, all animal. Championships main events, Batista will take them by force. And Jen to see what's best for business. And from British Connecticut, weighing in at 255 pounds, the game, Triple H. This stage is where Triple H is his most cerebral, his most brutal at the showcase of Immortals. WWE Universe knows that when it comes to Triple H, he always brings his very best, always competing at the absolute highest level. We are about to witness a master at work. psychologically dissecting his opponents. And many of the victims who have fallen for the Viper schemes stayed out for good. Always composed, always in control. No one is more calculated. Once legend killer, now possibly the greatest legend in WWE history. Solid impact. Oh, and there was 
some force on that move. Oh, my goodness. All right, back to it, returning to the ring. Laying up on the elimination. Possibly looking to root. Series of reversals. Oh, the Triple H counters. He manages to escape it. That hit connects from the range. Oh, that is going to leave a mark. Flying. That suplex into a powerball. My goodness. And that was a well-executed attack. Oh, close the line. Oh, release back suplex. And that was offense with a hurtful purpose. Display of offense we just witnessed there. Reigns comes up short on that attack. Great win with the ball on the counter. Oh, God, oh, here, Ranger Skull. Back suplex, no. And that was an efficient form of offense with that move. He's getting a little battered now. Into the hammerlock. Oh, boy. Back suplex. Driven down. Headlock. Oh, and cheap shot. Uh oh. Up they go. Flip the counter. And what a maneuver we just saw there. Big boot. Incredible. Nicely done. Snap suplex. So quick. Oh, 
submission, just oh. pure brutality. Come on, easy. Hurricane. Deep into this battle, and Cena is still doling out damage. Cena knows it's crunch time, the time where the greats come up in the clutch. Oh, here you go. Zachary. Can that finish the beast off? Nice running crossbody. Into the ring. Here we go. Rey Mysterio has him in position. Able to give him the slip. That Nelson fly. And that was a successful bit of offense with that maneuver. And Triple H certainly got the worst of that attack. This could be a very dangerous moment for Triple H. Turning the tables there. Driven down face first. Section prevents the attack. Well, Brock put a stop to that. And well timed maneuver there. He catches Cena with a counter. Ooh. Oh, what a kick. Okay, he's re entering the ring. Mysterio with a wrist lock. Watch this athleticism and agility. Takedown by Mysterio. Continues the attack on the court. It could prove to be an effective strategy. On the button with a low drop kick. in this match. These athletes' bodies can only take them so far. You have to imagine they're reaching their breaking point. Rey Mysterio has been eliminated. Cena's still divisive as ever with the WWE Universe, but you can't deny his legacy. Go behind. Attacks to his core could hinder his offense. Oh, the reversal by Cena. And that cuts Cena right off. Ooh. He deflects it right back. These two battling to a dead heat with these reversals. Great job refocusing to reverse that. A stalemate of counters. Pull back in, belly to belly suplex. Just punched him right in the mouth. Relentless. Enough already. And now I see some blood on the face of Cena. And attacking above the shoulders has become the strategy here. I don't think anybody can stop the beast incarnate. Rock 
Lesnar. What power! Brilliant! Cena's in trouble. Cena's in trouble. Pull back in. Belly to belly suplex. Just an overbearing attack from Brian. It is scary how much Lesnar enjoys dishing out this punishment. Brock with an opening to go high. Trying to find his base, but it looks like his end is near. Saw that one coming, took advantage. Cena has him up. Cena can end it there. Into the corner he goes, a perfectly placed target. What is Cena thinking? Wait, wait, wait a minute. No, no way. Cena's thinking about the end. Oh, an attitude adjustment. Is that going to decide it for Cena? This place is going insane. The ground beneath my feet is shaking. Close line. What impact. Lesnar moved. Flawless takedown. He's focused on breaking down his opponent's core right now, taking away the center of all movement. Cena warning him off. Power drop kick. Just like that, Cena gets intercepted. What's coming next? Taking their time. Oh, to the gut. I'll take the wind right out of you. And they just busted out an impactful maneuver. He's got him scouted. Oh, look at this. Fireman's carry takedown. Steer clear of that. And that was taking the attack to the competition with that one. Elbow drop. The piercing. Knee. Any more hits in that area could leave him dizzy. And more hits up there can leave you dazed. And finds a counter. Strong takedown there. And Cena with the wherewithal to counter. There's a fisherman suplex. Ah, uh, John Cena has it where he wants him. You can't see me. This is vintage Cena. The five-knuckle shuffle. But Cena knows he needs to stop Lesnar. Here's Cena. Cena with an attitude adjustment. Is that all Cena needs? He's burying elbows in the midsection. Lesnar on the wrong side of that exchange. Belly to belly. He's about to do it. He's about to do it again.